Dogs like it. So we had this humongous, big ass sectional couch. And we really liked it at first. It took up one half of the entire living room. And I didn't like it because a sectional is just a sectional. All right, plan B. So I was getting ready to like bring all this stuff in, this furniture, and uh, tried to lift one box and it's pretty damn heavy. So I'm gonna go to the storage unit where I have some two wheel dollies and get those because that'll make it a hell of a lot easier to bring this in because there is 11 pieces here. <laughs> We're gonna drive old Abby to the storage unit. All right, dolly secured. Eleven boxes. Eleven boxes of furniture. I'm so glad we had that dolly because it's not like heavy heavy, but it's heavy enough that it wouldn't be fun to carry. All right, so here's the furniture all unpacked. Um, and these are like, they're, they're modules. So all of these modules can be connected together. And then there's some that will have backs. So those are all backs laying on top here. Um, that's a side right there. So we got two sides, three, four sides right there. I think those are sides. And then, or maybe those are sides and those are backs. That makes more sense. Those are backs, those are, those are sides because they're thinner. I believe, I don't know yet. All I know is I think this modular system is amazing and how it works is you have these brackets and so once you get another piece next to this, you just put this bracket down in here like so into both pieces and then they're connected. So you would put one down here as well uh, and then they are connected together and won't move and then they have brackets that go on the inside as well that look like this and then every single one is a storage unit as well so there's storage inside each one um, and according to the documents according to what it says these things can hold up to a thousand pounds uh i don't know if i buy that but hey probably depends on how concentrated it is i would assume but so far i think they're nice and comfy the material is soft, nice and cushy, and right now makes for a good footrest to put my injured foot on. So I was unpacking the furniture and I pulled one of the things out and crushed my foot. I don't know if you can see the, the knot or not, but I don't know if you can see that or not, but holy cow. That hurt so bad. I've not had that much pain in a long time. I was pulling out one of the pieces of new furniture and I lifted the box up and I had taken the bottom out cause I was like, you know, I cut it both sides so that I could fold the boxes up really easy. Put them in this pile right here. And when I lifted it up, one of the bottoms was still under and it was like kind of on the floor. And then when it lifted up, it just fell straight out. 
right on the top of my freaking foot. Oh my God. You can see it in the time lapse. We're like unloading everything. And then all of a sudden there's a, there's a bit in the time lapse where I just disappear. And that's cause I'm like limping all around the, <laughs> the house off camera, just limping like a crazy man. Um, so yeah, I, I got one of the Ottomans here right now and I just set it up so that I could elevate my foot a little bit, but here in a second, I'm still going to get up and start assembling this furniture because I'm excited to get it all laid out the way that I want it. So ain't nothing going to break my stride. thing that I really like about this furniture is the fact that it is completely customizable. You can put it anywhere. It's configurable. Unlike a regular traditional sectional where you only have one way you can uh, set it up, you can rotate it of course, but only one way you can set it up. This, if I set it up this way and get it all put together and I'm like, you know what? This configuration just doesn't work. I can completely rearrange it and set it up in a different configuration. So right now what I'm thinking is I have a, basically a chase here and this is where I'll sit. That's like my, this is my section. And then two open uh, seats and then a lounge area in the corner. So you, anywhere you're sitting in the corner, you can put your legs up. And then I was thinking putting another one here that's just a regular seat at the end of here, but I'd have to move this over and it would no longer be centered. And I was thinking I could put the coffee table uh, right between these two right here, but I don't know if that would give us enough room to walk in there to get to the couch. And I still have two, two more pieces to put in here. So, so it's cool, but it's like you really got to think it through like, but the cool thing is like, like I said, in order to move it, I just have to pull some pieces out, slide it around and can put it in a completely different configuration. I could, I could do configuration of the month club if I wanted to change it every month. I won't be doing that, but I could. So we'll see. But so far, I really like it. Easy as hell to put together. And pretty damn cozy. Yeah. Feet up. Yeah, this is good. I just gotta put the legs on this now, but I mean, maybe do I have to put the legs on? Yeah, I still wanna put the legs on. I think it'd be weird if I don't. Right pizza? Right pizza? Am I right? Or am I right? Dogs like it. All right, so finally got the furniture set up and configured uh, the way that I like it. However, when I was doing like a inventory, I realized they didn't send a lot of it. I'm missing several backs uh, and I guess a couple sides, which I don't need any more sides, but I am missing some. This is how it's gonna be configured for now. And then when I get the other stuff, um, I'll see if I need to reconfigure it. I might not, I might use that as a chair over here in the corner somewhere but I gotta say 
putting it together, very simple. Um, it's very comfortable. We'll see how it is over time, but I even like the, the backs over here. And then this is my little section right here, my oasis to sit and watch YouTube and all that on the big screen TV. And the dog's already approved, except for this little one. She just had, uh, she was just neutered. Wait, spayed. But once I get the other packages and can reconfigure it, I will do an update and show you the final if you're interested in that. If you are, be sure to subscribe to the channel or follow or whatever, whatever platform you're watching these on and let me know what you think in the comments. Let's have a discussion, whatever, about anything. All right, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.